let me ask you go guys Eric. this. Okay. So yeah. it comes you guys are saying it comes down to Jimmy, right? I think so. Could the forty ers have a have a uh a high level off I mean defense that they get their running game and they get their control pass position game down and have it like a bare 85, 85 role. Okay, defense defense, di- defense dictates the game and they win right. on defense. As long as the right. offense don't shoot itself in the foot, control, right. get field goals, and manage the game without turnovers, then they got a chance from that standpoint. Do you guys think that can happen? Oh, yeah. Well, absolutely. Right. That's yeah. how I see it. I, I think the Niners are built with a stingy defense up front and they're going to have to win the time of possession in December football, in a deep playoff run, games are won down in the trenches. So it's very important that you control the line of scrimmage on both sides of the football, win the time of possession, keep points off the board, and all Jimmy G, all Jimmy G has to do is manage the game. As long as he right. doesn't make these quote unquote weird decisions that Grant Cole like to call, where he, you know, well, they play a lot of man, and then all of a sudden, yeah, all of a sudden the safety will roll over top, and then it comes into his own coverage, whether it's a cover two, cover three, or cover one. Then that's where Jimmy G gets into, in, into trouble. So if he can kind of pre-snap recognize what the defenses are trying to do, and to stay one step ahead, they're they're in good shape because Jimmy G just doesn't have to do much. All he has to do is manage the game, like you said, Eric. And the defense is already stout, so they're already set there. Now, okay, so you sound like a very analytical guy. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> 